All right, we got Young over. Last time we did a short video of him leaving, but today, since we have him, we're gonna talk more about his new setup. Well, the first question people get, or people ask is, how do you ride with this thing, dude? Does it turn weird or? The tire? Yeah. No, you know what? Surprisingly, it, it turns really good. Really? Like compared to that last tire <laughs> I had on there. With these on the front, when it turns, it at a certain angle, it just drops into the turn. Oh. And so that's what made it sketchy. This one, it's uh, it turns a lot slower, but it's more predictable. And I really like it, man. And it was only 85 bucks, which is pretty cheap. Are you planning to do the same for the rear? To match? Yeah, that's in the works. That's, um, I got some parts ordered it for it. Remember I told you? Yeah. I, I got the axle. I got the 16 inch wheel because uh, these they only come in 16 inch and like 15 inch is what I have on the in the rear yeah and so it's not gonna work so I'm taking the wheel from my shovel head and slapping that over and then I got the axle and then you got to space out the, the sprocket because it's not gonna line up yeah so I got that already and then now I'm waiting on sprocket specialist to make a custom sprocket because um, uh, the Harley sprockets are usually like 50 tooth. Yeah. And these Hondas are like 41, 40 something. Oh, wow. You know? But yeah, they're, they're setting it. And the, the, the minute I get it, I'm probably going to slap it on. Sick. Can't wait for that, dude. It's going to look crazy. It's going to... Well, it, dude, it's going to be a lot of work, man. Cause, yeah, because you got to do the... We do the fender. Yeah, because look at the gap. We only got like an inch. Yeah, it's not going to fit for sure. And then that tire... It's, I'm running the same one. For the rear it's a good two inches bigger than uh, one of those so it's gonna rub yeah so you gotta take out the fender we do the sissy bar too right yeah well, i might just go no sissy i don't know but i got that fender from um dennis the one the, the electric guide flh one yeah yeah so i'm probably gonna put that one on you know that's the one with the you know kicks up yeah like the duck bill this is new, huh? The the bag? Mm, that's for spare I gas. I don't think you have this bag on before. Uh, I got two of those. One's for my hydro flask that I drink water out of, and then this for gas, right? This well, for yeah, gas. for now it's for gas, but <laughs> on long trips. Uh, let's see. I think last time you did the video was before a trip, right? Yeah. Before. Yeah, and that's when I had that the older motor on there. Remember? Remember that's I swapped it out? So on that trip, man, with all the luggage I was carrying. This thing was a slug, like going through Yosemite or the Sonora Pass. Yeah. Like I didn't have no power going uphill. And it could be all because of all the weight I was carrying, but um, I just felt that the motor was really weak. Yeah. So then I had this motor. How does it feel compared to the old motor? It's a lot more crisp. It's crisp. Uh, Even with the, the heavy front tire, it feels faster? Yeah. I mean, I don't even know if the old motor was that bad. But I just did it for a peace of mind because I'm older with yeah. old. Redemption this year. Yeah. But this year we're not gonna hit any uh, rain, hopefully. Yeah, plus this year we're not going like uh, Labor Day weekend. Yeah. So, you know, less crowded and yeah, less people. Born Free was cool. We rode it almost up to Mulholland. Yeah. And no issues there. I mean, what kind of oil are you running in here, dude? <laughs> what kind of oil do you have in here? Oh. <laughs> Looks good. This is where I, I keep my secret stash. <laughs> uh, what else? I don't think I've done anything else, man. Just ride it. You don't need to. It's like the look is like almost. No, I mean, uh, I thought I was going to get a maybe a bigger bike or maybe fix a shovel. But for now, this is more than capable. Yeah, and you enjoy it, you know? No, yeah, and you've seen the trips we go on, man. It, it makes it. I mean, yeah, I mean, it made it to EDR, dude. You know, to Mexico. Well, <laughs> fucking... <laughs> Kinda. It's not how you start, right? It's how you end, so... You got there. Yeah. Yeah, I can't wait for the uh, the new wheel in the rear. I know, it's gonna, it's, it's gonna, it's look, gonna look like a tank, man. It's gonna look ridiculous. Because the, the motor already looks small. <laughs> I just think of it like... Kind of like a Rebel 250, a <laughs> Rebel 250. Yeah, it's gonna be like my bike, dude. <laughs> a big old bike with a tiny motor. But that's the fun, you know, that's the fun part. Yeah, I don't give a fuck, man, it works. Yeah. I mean, worst case, I'll just ride around town. Yeah. 
but I mean, you can always turbo it. <laughs> <laughs> Man, I'm trying to make my motor reliable. <laughs> yeah, I'm probably gonna go back to the old other pipes too, the shotguns. You don't like this one? No, they're. I don't know. It's the fishtails, but it's. It's too loud, huh? It's like right next to my ear, and it's ear piercing, it's, man. It's, it's the fishtail, dude. Fucking, it, it's a pitch that... It's the, the, the pitch from the fishtail. All fishtail have that, that yeah, little pitch. Yeah, that little pitch that's yeah. just ear piercing, like... Because it comes big, right? It becomes small. Yeah, you're like... Compressing it, pretty much. But even with my headphones on, and I turn my headphones on like full blast. It's crazy. At least it's safe, right? People know you're coming. <laughs> plus, plus, my uh, shotguns were like two inch. These are inch and three quarters. This is for the brake on. Huh? Yeah. Oh yeah, so when I get that new oh, you wheel on, I know uh, I gotta go hydraulic. Yeah. I mean, it's gonna be some work. Yeah, custom. That's what it's, it's about. a lot of work, actually. One of one, right? Yeah. Try and do a one to one. I mean, right now it's already a one to one, but it's gonna be one of one. Even well, more. you know, I like the look of the front tire or front wheel being bigger than the rear. Cause you know, like normal bikes, like the 21 inch front with like a 16 inch rear. It just looks, the lines of it look better, but. Yeah. Um, but now you can be squared off. Yeah, like a. Uh, it's kind of like a cafe racer almost, right? Because most of them are square, right? Yeah, yeah. It's cool to try it. If it works, know? it works, if not. Yeah. If not, I'll put it back to this one. Yeah. Cause it's a whole complete setup, you know? If you don't like it, you put this one back. You know, it's not like you're taking this and modify it. Yeah, well, I mean, I, like I said, I already got the, the wheel. Yeah. I love how beefy the, the shifter is, man. A lot of guys, they run skinny ass shifters that don't look right. Oh yeah, this is new. Remember? Yeah. This is the line. bell, the good luck bell. I, I never ran one of these, but. <laughs> you gotta believe it in now, dog. <laughs> I could sure use the luck sometimes. Uh. Yeah. Let's uh, let's turn it on. Let's see how uh, how it sound like with the fishtail. <laughs> Doesn't sound bad right now, but. What's this? One remember, and then had the shotguns. Oh. Shotguns, and then it would. My boot would burn on the, the pipes because it was so close. Oh, oh, like protect your boot from it, got yeah. it. Ah. I'm glad it didn't cut it off. Makes sense, yeah. Yeah, like, and plus, I had the ripples on here too, you know, the yeah, yeah. the one that Mike and Frank uh, told me about. Yeah. And it was right here, so I couldn't wrap it. I mean, I could wrap it, but it just- It's gonna kill the look, looks, you know? Yeah, it looks like shit. Yeah. The whole point is that you just want to show up the ripple. Yeah. So, I mean, yeah, it's kind of ugly, but whatever. That's cool. But there's a purpose, you know? There's yeah. a purpose for it. I feel a little more confident to to hug the tank. That's pretty cool. I like that. Yeah, I love all the brass accent to it. And then the seat color, too. Very oh, yeah, this, tasteful. This is, I think this is, I redid this. What's in the bag? Tools? Yeah, tools. That's from um, when we were at Born Free. I didn't want to be asked out. <laughs> yeah. I like it. But yeah, all right, man. Thanks for showing us your bike, man. Thanks, man. See you on a trip. We got a new helmet right here. This is why you uh, have a sissy bar, guys. Become uh, anything, like a hat rack. Make shadows cheap again. <laughs> Make shadows good again. <laughs> hey, thanks for gloves, man. Yeah, no problem. Fits good? Yeah. Yeah, these are the lane split gloves available now on the site. Alright, man. Alright, later. Ride safe.